Hello everybody and welcome back to my little corner of YouTube. This is Let It Die. A game that I've been playing for a while now. And uh, I'm just gonna hop right back into it because I am loving the heck out of this. Alright, so as you can see, things look a little bit different from where I left off in the last video, and that's because I've been playing a little bit more behind the scenes. I'm not gonna lie, this game is a bit of a grind. So I'm gonna take care of the less entertaining parts in between the videos, and then only move forward whenever I've got something interesting to show. This particular character I've gotten leveled up as far as I can. So now I'm gonna hop forward to the floors that I haven't gone past yet. I'll show you guys anything entertaining that happens along the way, and other than that, I will be right back when it's time to move on. Just as soon as I take the collar off my dog, so she doesn't interrupt any more of this. Come here, Luna. Come here. Get over here. Hi there, gonna smash your face in with my lovely hammer, yes I will. If that hammer's not enough, then I've got a second one as well. Yeah. Ding ding, third floor, lingerie, feminine hygiene products, and forwarding the plot. Oh, it's you. Oh, I remember you. Ah, uh, you're not gonna have such an easy time with me this time. I gotten better, gotten stronger. <laughs> That's right. Come and get me. There we go. You got your butt stuck in the ground, didn't you? Ah! Not so tough when I know how to fight you. Ooh, hi there. Wow, you sound angry. Come on. All right, you know what? There's the problem, I had the gun select. Smack your face down. You and there goes you. Ha <laughs> ha. And there goes my mastery of the bat. Ooh, what's this? Attack up. Oh, I like that. Get him, get him. <laughs> I love the frogs. Oops. I missed. Remember the jump button. Hello. I like to smack your face open with a pipe wrench. It's a trap! Oh god, my everything broke. That's bad timing. I live! I'll take that. Kaboom! Oh, it's brutal. I love it. Me too, Death. Me too. <gasps> pants! I like pants. They keep my legs warm when I'm roasting you with my rockets. This floor feels really strange to me. You're not afraid, man? Whoa, you're really brave, man. I mean, I'm not that brave. That's just the next place to go. The 
Hello! Oh, that's a lot of legs. And meat. And torsos. There's too many torsos for one body. I knew, I knew, I knew something bad was going Oh, goodness. Happen. That thing there is what you call a middle boss. A middle boss. Dodge! Ow, my pants! Ooh. That was surprisingly easy. Nice work, man. I knew you could take out that ugly piece of shit. Well, uh, you're gonna be a legend. Maybe. Tagahara. A new alarm? Quests and mail. Hmm. Senpai, I just sent you a super important text right now. Be sure to read it. <laughs> all right, all right, I'll take a look. Online mode. What? Uh, okay. Apparently, some of the doors that I couldn't get through before get unlocked when I go after a mid-boss. So that's something worth looking into. Okay. Mm Spooky fog at the end of a long hallway, or elevator back to the entrance. I think I know which one I'm gonna use. I don't like fighting naked. Oh. Someone fixed the phones. They seem happy about it. Oh, good. So it has a multiplayer mode. I mean, more than just seeing the corpses of your fallen uh, co-players. Apparently, you can also go to someone else's game and attack them directly. Go. Jesus! You for using the Tokyo Death Metro. You're probably you the creepiest thing I've seen today. today. My name's Tetsuo. Nice to meet you. Jump straight into the details. You'll be able to access other waiting rooms when using the Death Metro. Take a moment for yourself before the action begins. This thrilling route lets you raid them when nobody is home. First, you need to choose your team and complete registration. Teams consist of yourself and fellow players divided into regional groups. Play fair now. What if I don't wanna? You can choose any region. So be daring. And choose carefully. Can I choose no region? Can I just stay isolated in my own game? Apparently, I cannot. Thank you for registering. Your special team flag will be put inside your waiting room soon. Do them proud. You can change your team at no cost, just once. But after that, you'll be charged. So be warned. Please enjoy Tokyo Death Metro's Luxury Attack Liner. Oh, and as a special bonus, your first ride is free. Head to this ticket machine, the Metro front, whenever you're ready. Let's, uh, jump in a moment. I, I don't... I really don't want to. I mean, I'll be completely honest, that's a part of the game I would prefer to just ignore. Completely. Well, why can't I use the elevator? I want to go upstairs! Thank you for riding with us today. Let's get to another waiting room. Pretty sure this is what they want me to do. Hold on to something. It's going to get bumpy. Drama train. This is the way we ride the train, ride the train, ride the train. This is the way we ride the train. It looks pretty uncomfortable. It's hammer time! What am I doing? Raid! Take the train from the metro front to go and attack other players' waiting rooms. But be warned, their fighters will be waiting for you. I like the music. Hey guys, this is Tolis checking in from the editing booth. It. Uh, it's about this point that I realized that I didn't actually do any commentary on this part because I was thoroughly confused about what I was supposed to be doing. 
So basically the way this works is you go and raid another person's camp, and you break their tanks and gather the material. So basically what I'm doing right now is just really trying to wrap my head around things. And in a minute here, I'm going to discover that you can actually capture your downed foes. You pick them up, take them with you to the train. You, you effectively take them prisoner and you can gather loot from them later on. It takes some time for that loot to come in, but it definitely seems to be worth it because it's stuff that you can't really get in the main game. Yeah, come in with me. So, now that I've said all that, I'll get back to the game. Here we go. All aboard! Hey, you just walked past a balloon. That had something important to tell you. Did you just leave him in the bathroom? Well done. That was a great fight. The fighter you caught is in the restroom. You did? Go ahead and check in on them. What are you? Of course there's a premium service for that. There's a premium service for everything in this game. Don't ever have to use it, but... Hello. Ooh. Uncle Death says that I should set up some defenses. Probably not a bad idea. Defense settings. There we go. Alright, so what I can tell so far is that people can attack me. Pretty much at any time they want. So I need to actively level up a variety of characters instead of just the one like I've been doing in order to keep everything safe so that I don't lose my collections. Oh, good God. This game is complex. All right, so I think I'm going to go ahead and leave it there for this episode. I've got a little bit of work to do before trying to move on again, setting up my defenses, getting more characters. There is so much to this game, and I only just recently found out about the premium currency. You don't need to play it. I mean, you don't need to buy it to beat the game. I've been reading online. A lot of people have been able to play it all the way through to the end just fine without it, but apparently it does make it easier. I'm going to try and do it without. So, that's going to be all for this episode. And uh, there's not really much else to say, so I will see you in the next video. Have a nice day.